Peasants! I don't think the enemy are quite that nose. Welcome to Kingly United Gaming as we're about to start this 3v3 replay match that we had alongside the pyramids. So we're doing a flyover here. <clears throat> as this battle is quick, it's only 20 minutes. We had a 3v3. We're on the right flank here. And we're going to go across left and we'll probably do an actual flyover and give an entire roster. So we're with our allies here with the Royal Cappadocians, with our, which are Armenia. We have these armored legionaries leading the way, veteran legionaries in the back. We have Armenia stacked four deep, like absolute monster army here. Truly, truly threatening. And then we have the Galatians with their legionaries. The Raiders holding up on the left, and they also have these Shadow Warriors, Skatha Shadows, which are ambushing units, which are phenomenal 
They play a crucial role here as we're facing off as Rome. We're facing off against Spartan. These royal Spartans. The Bowiei are taking up the center here. As this is going to be an absolute awesome fight. Again, we're going to do probably a much better overview. And let's just get this fight along the way. We'll do it in slow motion for a little bit. As we pretty much take the aggressor. And we have Macedon pretty much just making up this entire line here. It's pretty awesome. So we play as aggressor. We pretty much from the get-go tell our ally Armenia over here in the center, hey, we're going to rush right into Sparta and just pretty much steamroll through them. As we have, in essence, three lines, but we're trying to be a little conservative in a way because I know we're going to have to deal with enemies to assist our allies over here on the left flank so let's see how this fight overall unfolds now initially we thought Macedon was going to play a very aggressive role here in the way that they were moving Bowie I was moving at an interesting angle here Sparta was in essence reforming we start moving in our cavalry and Praetorian cavalry. Truly awesome units here. And we move up the entire army all at once. We don't piecemeal. We have the Royal Cap Cataphracts holding the right flank here. And let's see, there's going to possibly be an engagement that doesn't, doesn't take too long for the battle to really unfold and really pick up. Pretty much press each other. I start moving in these armored legionaries at an angle to help out our, our, our Galatian player because Armenia, I would say took a passive approach, but they were reassessing and going around with the cavalry a lot. Over here, they have Galatian Raiders trying to attack this uh, Thessalian cavalry. And we're not going to leave our ally over here alone as we reform our lines here. And this fight is about to be on their way. And this fight is about to start. We're about to engage here. Exchange and charge in. Beautiful. There we go. And the fight is raging. It took about two minutes for our lines to really form up and engage here. But these royal cataphracts just getting absolutely slaughtered. They somehow stay alive. Oh my god. Somehow stay alive long enough to get a charge off these levy freemen, but it's not much use. Here comes our armored legionaries at a Pretty much angle charge. Veteran legionaries are about to exchange with these oath sworn. Now Sparta still hasn't engaged this yet over here on the right. We pull back here to reform. Some of them pretty much took the jab of fire. They took that head on. Survived a lot of it. Now here comes the Armenian player with the Persian Hoplites coming to assist us. Veteran Legionaries getting ready to charge in against these uh, Spartans. Now I'm not sure if the Spartan player has realized but these Scathish Shadows have started moving but they are hidden to him. So flanking force is pretty much shifting into place as this battle is heavily unfolding into the center. Bowie player is taking massive 
massive damage here. These mercenary Cappadocian cavalry charging in. We have Bolii heavy horse trying to clear the way here. Reinforcements of Praetorian Guard and First Cohort coming into the center. As we're about to charge in against the Spartans over here on the right flank. And the fight is unfolding here. Now they begin to shift over a flanking force of Royal Spartans on our armored legionaries. But we send in our reinforcing unit of Praetorian Guard. As we're about to charge in here. Beautiful. Praetorian Guard just about to get this charge in. And here comes the shadows. Right, now. Well, Spartans realizing that they have been outflanked here. Galatian raiders charging into these Helot slingers. Absolutely annihilating their skirmishers here. We have our Praetorian cavalry as well. Heavy horse are taking damage. Unfortunately, these Persian hoplites just got surrounded here, taking a little bit of lag just due to the amount of units are on the field here. Thessaly and cavalry are engaged in against these Galatian legionaries. Getting reinforced here by Persian hoplites. They're starting to disengage. Oswin are charging in with some thorax pikemen. And some more royal cataphracts are coming in. Pikes are down there. We have a huge bulge in the center here. Praetorians holding the center. Sokei Stradinari. Of the Persian hoplites over here fighting. Royal Spartans are getting pretty much sandwiched. So have these Royal Spartans getting slowly surrounded. The solid frontier. The Spartans are starting to shift and lose. Even though our line is thin, they will slowly get whittled down. As our allies finally getting these rear charges here with these shadows. Getting these flanking charges. Yes. Now, they're not able to hold back the Thessalian cavalry here. Unfortunately, but should be able to do quite a bit of damage. Cappadocian cavalry try to get into a charge there, but unfortunately we're not able to do much. Pikes are down here as these oath sworn are fighting with these Galatian swords and Persian hoplites. Allies are suffering heavily on the left as we're trying to get these flanking forces. Royal Spartans are taking losses here. Ooh. They just took a rear volley, about to take this rear charge here. We're leaving the last of our legionaries here that are holding on. Archer fire coming in at an angle here. About to pulverize them. As the Spartans are just hanging on, trying to block up. But they're just taking damage from all sides. They're trying to make almost like a kind of rectangle formation, which we were not super opposed to, simply because they were taking massive losses and they struggled against our enemies flanking or our allies flanking force. And we're about to get another cavalry charge here with our Praetorian cavalry. Gonna check this out. Should be coming any moment unless if I decided to click away there. So we have these shadows coming in to flank in against them. Line is holding here. And here comes the charge. Beautiful. Spartans just ate it there. 
the Praetorians finally were able to get some kills there. Spartans probably are on the verge of breaking at that moment as they shift back. Our men are chasing them down. The fight is becoming a bloodbath here. These Royal Spartans are pretty much sandwiched. We have Archer Fire coming over the top. I think this is why I started rearranging the Archer Fire. Yep, they start coming in against this pikeman with close Javi fire. Let's see, let's see what the left flank is unfolding. So the Armenians with our Praetorians are holding the center here against this Bolii. Oathsworn are just outnumbered here. Now these Oathsworn have a flanking. Armenia still has six units in reserves. Macedon barely pretty much getting into the mix here. Let's see, we have a Praetorian cow shifting around here in the rear. We have a lot of this archer fire coming, taking out a lot of these fleeing Spartans. We have veteran legionaries coming in to support. Noble horse coming in. Archer fire coming in the rear here against these Spartans. See how they do here. Oh ho ho! Those rear volleys. By our Scythian archers over here. Wow. Just absolutely shredded their line here. So it looks like our legionaries hung on for the day. Royal Spartan shattering here. One of these last units, pretty much sandwiched. Praetorian cavalry patrolling around here. Allies pretty much one in the center as our Praetorians start charging here against the Macedonian at shield bearers. Helping out our royal cataphracts in the center. What a fight. What a fight. Absolute wild fight here. For Rome indeed. Oh, we didn't mean to actually pull our thing over here. So let's do a little flyover on the battle. Absolutely wild here. Absolute bloodbath. Bowie Eye holding the center. As our ally over here is just steamrolling the Spartans with us. These Kaitha shadows from Galatia. These Armenian hoplites helping us out from Persia. A Praetorian Cavalry getting this rear charge in against these Oaths sworn in the center against Bowie Eye. Praetorian Guard shifting off here. As we're about to get them around in essence as these units are pinned. So we're going to shift them around and get this side charge pretty much. To help out our ally here, as Praetorians do a ridiculous amount of damage. And I think we'll be able to help out our ally here. Reinforcements coming in in the center, these Axemen. Here comes these Noble Spear finally. The rest of these Armenian troops, Noble Spears charging in here. Against these Shield Bearers. Beautiful. Should be a ridiculously epic fight over here as they start charging in. The rest of these axemen. The rest of these hoplites. Noble spearmen charging through the bush. Pikes still have not put their pikes down. They're able to get this charge without them. 
Beautiful. As this fight is unfolding, balance of power is almost even here. Even with all the damage and us annihilating that entire army of Sparta. We're getting this rear charge on these shield bearers. Here comes the second unit of Praetorian Cavalry. Now Sparta has pretty much just got wiped off the field. And do a little flyover of their corpses and ours. A lot of Roman shields suffered here. A lot of Roman shields. So we start sending the rest of our forces over here to reform. Help our allies with reinforcements. Cavalry is pretty much shifting around. Here goes our first cohort. They start charging in, tossing Pelum. Nice Pelum volley against these veteran legionaries. Into the shield bearers, almost like side. Now these mercenary Cretan archers are shifting in the rear. The shadow somehow got behind these pikemen, which is just amazing. So over here, it doesn't look too great for these axemen. They're sandwiched between these two hoplite units, shield bearers, and just regular. Have very few reinforcements left. As this has become a grind fest. Our general's bodyguard is right there. These shadows are about to charge in, I believe, over here on the side. Let's see what these, where these noble horse are going to wander off to. Yep. We start ch charging them into these archers. Absolutely epic charge here against these archers. These Crete archers from Macedon. Just struggling to fight off our cavalry here. Shadows are about to get this rear charge here. Onto these royal peltas. As the fight is unfolding here. Truly epic clash. In this 3v3 that we did randomly. As our buddy was the ally here. Armenia. Holding it together. These Macedonians just not being able to hold the weight of Armenia. Here comes our cavalry. General with the Praetorian cavalry and the noble horse as assistance. Beautiful. What an epic fight here. Here comes the pikemen. Cavalry starts peeling off as the pinball of the cavalry just begins. They just start shifting around as the shield bearers start breaking off. We have Praetorian guard getting the side charge here. With these shield bearers. Ooh, one just got taken out by that spear. Let's see, these pikemen, Thorax pikemen are still holding on. Noble spearmen have just shattered here. Noble Spearmen are still hanging on over here. We have these Noble Horse engaging these mercenary Cretan archers of Macedon. This is becoming an absolute carnage of a bloodbath of a battle. Like there are bodies slewed everywhere here. From the entire front, from where we were to the right side all through this left, all scattered through the back here. Not so much our side, because <laughs> we kind of protected our rear flank quite well. I think that was the defining factors that we were able to guard our rear flank. Here comes the last of our legionaries. Shockingly, the last four minutes of the battle, we still had units in the mix, charging in here. Absolutely wild here. So we got this fight in against these pikemen. Last of the legionaries going in over here. Last of the cavalry just charged in right there. 
Beautiful. So, Macedonians are pretty much clustering over here. As we start thinning out our line to counteract them. But the Armenians have enough troops. Noble Horse come into a massive charge to alleviate this charge in Macedonians. We have some of these shadows forming up here. Taking on this charge. We have some reinforcing Armenians coming back. As the Noble Horse starts peeling off yet again. These Noble Spearmen are mixed in. Balance of power is pretty much dead even here. Dead even. We're just getting these crazy charges over here. Hoplites just got flanked. Getting the side charge. Some of our legionaries are starting to break here finally just due to the amount of exhaustion and low numbers that they are running. Hoplites are still holding on here. Noble Horse get this side charge. Absolutely annihilating this line. Oh, uh, these hoplites are getting side charged. These pikemen are clustering, which become a problem. Thick unit of shield bearers here. Now here comes our auxiliary Scythian archers as they are out of ammo into the fight. Just trying to pin whatever infantry we can. Praetorians are still hanging on here. Shield bearers are fighting the Praetorians, becoming a small fight. Small tactics fight here. Noble horse just got a charge here on their hoplites to just shatter them. Uh, still a unit of shield bearers there, and this other second of shield bearers. We have them surrounded. Oh, and these Thorax pikemen. Noble Horse are still hanging on here. Pretty much the defining factor is about to get this massive charge here. Boom. What a fight here. What a fight. Praetorian Guard is still in the mix here against these last shield bearers. As they're helping out our Scythian archers. And this is a bloodbath. Absolute bloodbath with the pyramids. Last of Praetorians are charging in against their shield bearers. So they got that rear charge. 23 Praetorian guards still hanging on there for the glory of Rome. And it looks like we're about to get the side charge here with our general. Praetorians are still holding on. And here comes this last charge here onto the shield bearers. Absolutely wild fight here. As their last unit just broke. Absolutely epic replay. This is King Leonidas Gaming. Thank you for joining.